Look at this one. Look at that one. Tell me. There are some sort of fundamental things about acoustic guitars of quality that uh, make you know, improvements or things that um, gives, gives the instrument an edge. Um, one thing is um, ebony. Uh, ebony is far more expensive than rosewood and uh, getting harder to get good quality ebony. Fingerboards traditionally were made from ebony and bridges. Uh, this guitar has an ebony fingerboard and an ebony bridge. It also has a spruce top that is made from Adirondack spruce, which is a uh, more expensive timber generally than Sitka. Uh, it depends which grade they are, but Adirondack is high, highly regarded as a good, good spruce. This guitar is all solid. Uh, um, I've had these in stock for quite a long time. Beautiful guitar, very light, uh, mahogany, solid mahogany back and sides. No laminate here, so it's an all-solid instrument. Uh, uh, it even has a one-piece neck, which is a, a small thing, but the neck is, hasn't got a, uh, a, a, you know, hasn't been... Uh, in order to cut a neck from a big piece of timber, you know, you've got to use a large piece. So often manufacturers will put a join here and they extend this with another piece. So it's a one-piece neck that has uh, a lot of great characteristics. Um, it's a Let's say it's a dreadnought, uh, full size, great bluegrass, a quintessential bluegrass guitar, but you know, uh, you can use it in any style. But it's called an MD18 in Nashville. And um, these guitars, when they first arrived, they were uh, $1,200 and worth every penny actually i mean for an all solid instrument with ebony fittings and an adirondack top it was a bargain uh, but the brand name nashville isn't well known uh, and uh, so you know i've got a few of these in guitar gallery and pre-christmas sale <sighs> you know <laughs> what can you say <laughs> they should run out the door and i don't mind if they don't but that's what they're going for until christmas